Hi, my name is May and I'm the Regional Head of APAC at the CIPD. One of the key findings in our People Profession Survey report for APAC were mixed views from people professionals on the impact of hybrid working on people management. Australian practitioners were most likely to say it's impacted positively, making people objectives easier to deliver. In comparison, Singapore respondents commonly said it's made HR delivery more difficult. Challenges including supporting employees' mental health and well-being and attracting, recruiting and retaining talent. Perceptions of hybrid working vary significantly when we account for age and years of experience within the profession. Younger people professionals aged 18 to 34 were more likely to perceive people management easier to deliver in a hybrid context. Early career people professionals, those with up to five years experience, were more likely to believe hybrid working makes people management easier. So the call to action, hybrid, flexible and new ways of working are here to stay and will have implications for people and business strategies. Understanding how it impacts people management will be critical for people teams and people managers. Another key finding in our People Profession Survey report for APAC, engaging with the workforce is a unanimous priority area across all APAC countries. Additionally, respondents from Australia, Malaysia and Singapore are focusing on developing and building skills as a top priority, significantly more than the global sample. For many of our APAC respondents, a cultural reset is needed to focus on employee experience, engagement and culture in a post-pandemic workplace. To find out more about our People Profession Survey report, click on the link in the post or visit CIPD.org.